Hey friends, Tashin here. Recently announced the Build a Meditation Habit course. This is a new online course that I'm launching. It'll be a month-long cohort-based online course that will help you develop a meditation habit. If you've had trouble starting a meditation habit, or you're new to meditation, or you'd just like to have a new approach to practice, then this course could be a good fit for you. Um, it comes from really my own experience with meditation. Um, I've been meditating for the last 10 years or so with about five years of monastic training at the Monastic Academy. And for a lot of that time, meditation actually wasn't that fun for me. It was something that I did out of a sense of sort of obligation, that it was a good thing to be doing for myself that would be helping me, but it wasn't necessarily fun. It was something that I often was sort of forcing myself to do and frankly, sort of put myself in the monastic container so that I would have to meditate, which was helpful and helped me to get better at meditation, but it was also um, a recurring challenge for me until really the last few years when I started to really just actually enjoy meditate, meditating. It was something that started to be fun, started to be enjoyable, pleasurable, insightful, interesting in a way that it hadn't been for the first years of my practice. And that's a shift that I don't think it has to take years to happen. Um, I think that the way that you approach meditation and mindfulness really has a big impact on whether it's fun or not. And so uh, that's what this course is all about. It's helping you develop a habit that's consistent and uh, making it fun and effective as well. So actually, one of my goals for this course is that it should be, frankly, like the easiest online course that you'll ever take. The minimum requirement for the course is meditating for five minutes a day for the whole time, which is 28 days, one month, from April 7th to, I believe, uh, early May. So uh, that should be a pretty easy course. All you have to do to succeed is meditate every day for five minutes during that time. If you do that, you've succeeded. Um, and then even though it should be the easiest course you've ever taken, I also want it to be one of the most impactful, ideally, because doing meditation every day for at least five minutes will set you up for a meditation habit that you can sustain ideally for the rest of your life. And when you do have a meditation practice that you show up to regularly, that you enjoy, and it starts to have those benefits, then then really good things start to happen. When you're showing up regularly, you're enjoying it. That's when the real benefits start to happen. <clears throat> so that's what this course is all about, and I'll be helping you to do that. And so I want to talk a little bit about this video about what the course will entail that will be helping you to have this kind of fun, consistent, effective practice. Um, frankly, it's going to be a little bit emergent. This is my first time teaching the course. Who knows if we'll do it again multiple times. So it'll be a little bit exploratory as to what the course will involve, what exactly, quest what questions people have, what problems they're running into. We'll be working with whatever comes up for the people in the course. But I can tell you a few things. So one thing is that... Um, I'm a huge fan of loving-kindness practice, metta. This is something I talk a lot about on Twitter, on my blog, and you know, it's something that I discovered about three years ago in earnest in my own practice, but really transformative practice, and I think this is a really good default for most people. It can have difficulties or challenges for certain kinds of people, certain kinds of experiences, but by and large, it's a really enjoyable, delightful technique, and it's a good default. So I'll be talking a lot about loving-kindness practice, and exploring that and helping you to learn it, try it out, see if it works for you. And um, we'll be doing a lot of that as kind of a sane default for meditation practice. But we're also going to be trying other techniques. There are a lot of meditation techniques out there, and I'll be encouraging everyone to explore these different techniques and see what resonates for them, what's interesting to them, and then going in that direction. So even though metta, loving kindness, will be a default technique for the course, it's not going to be a requirement. You can explore other techniques. You can bring a technique that you're familiar with. It's all good, as Shenzhen says. <clears throat> um, I'll also be talking a lot about meditation postures. So, um, you know, the default position of sitting is um, what most of us think of when we think of meditation. Sitting in, you know, say full lotus or half lotus or the Burmese style where your legs are folded on top of each other. And all that's good. That That's the image for a reason. Those, those postures do help you to uh, learn to meditate effectively, to concentrate effectively, to relax in your body. But there are other postures as well. There's standing, lying down, and walking. And so we'll be talking about those three postures and really encouraging you to do those postures. 
doing the lying down, doing the standing, going for walking meditation, whatever feels good to you and your body, which may not be sitting meditation. <clears throat> um, yeah, so th that's a sneak preview of some of the content of the course of what we'll be talking about, but um, we'll be meeting once a week, optional group calls every week, and then those will also be recorded and sent out so that if you can't make the time, you can watch it at your own convenience. Um, there'll be a lecture about meditation. There'll be some guided practice and a chance to discuss what's been, what we've been learning or practicing or experiencing in our practice. And then again, the, the, the cornerstone of the, the whole course will be your own daily meditation practice of at least five minutes um, for the whole 28 day period. Uh, if you're interested in this course, if it seems exciting, do check it out. Um, it's a sliding scale offering, so everyone should be able to afford this course if you're interested in it. And you can reach out to me if it's challenging for some reason, your finances can't afford it. I really want this course to help everyone that's interested so that you can develop your own meditation practice that benefits you and your life and um, is also enjoyable. So uh, let me know if you have any questions or concerns. And also, if you do happen to know someone that's trying to create a meditation habit right now, that's actively trying to create a meditation practice, please do share the course information with them as well, because I'd love to work with them and they may find some benefit in the course as well. So thank you so much. Hope you um, check out the course and hope to see you there.